Okay, let's get this show on the road because we have a lot to do today. I am now in direct competition with Peter, Emma and Marco. I need to get them out of here somehow, either by quitting or, you know. And I also need to play with the Dong. Oh yeah, and the biometric safe. I forgot that in the last episode. It's because I th still think that I need to talk someone, uh, talk to someone about it before I start opening it. But I should have actually... You know what? Let's just start off the episode like that. New information about Caleb Redgrave. Received Heimdall codes. Uh, can I read them somehow? I already read this. I don't... Did I get something else? Heimdall codes. Uh, codes. Collected. 10 out of 250... Wow. Uh, skills. Where are we? What are we doing here? I think I know how to do this one. Because he talked about... Um, he took pills for headaches. And in MS stall, uh, we found pills. Uh, laxative pills. So I think that's how to do that one. The competition, however, not so sure. I'm a little afraid that I might have to flirt with Emma to do some meds. Uh oh. Comrade Redgrave. Comrade Ferguson wants to see you. Shouldn't keep him waiting. Okay, well. Oh, hi. Oh, hey, hey. Oh, big man. Hi. Oh, ho. ah, shit. Who is it? Redgrave, you expect me to sit on my ass waiting all day? I want pictures, big pictures of Spider-Man, someone. What took you so damn long? Uh, I was... Did I say you could speak? Shut up and listen. I agreed to take you on board here because your father trusted me and asked me to help you out. Now it's time to return the favor. <gasps> I should breathe. Get the picture. Ah, he does want pictures of Spider-Man. I don't really understand what you're... I'm sure you don't. Your father was the sharp one, and I see that the apple of intelligence fell far from the freaking tree in your case. So here's the short version. You owe me. Uh, how much? Hi, you cats on Craig. You owe me a for life. But to start, I want you to pretend to be a visitor to the ministry. One of those da uh, those bastards sitting in the hall has been stealing my money. Do you see? Not really. Are you a complete idiot? I'm saying that one of those pricks in the hall is pocketing the money that the visitors gives. Uh, you do know that all bribes have to be given over into the government revenue, don't you? Oh, I haven't even started doing bribes yet, sir. I'm working on it, but not quite there. And in your case, the government is me and some rat is stealing from me. All block-headed security guards can't catch him, so I've come up with an ingenious operation that I call Secret Visitor. You've got a fo you've got a forgettable face. Oh, thank you. So you can pass for a common visitor. I want you to give him an envelope and an envelope and I'll see if he gives me the money. Okay. Is that all? And pictures of Spider-Man. Did you really get all that on your first try? Get the fake money from my courier. There'll be a guard waiting for you by the vending machine. He'll fill you in on the rest. Uh, report back as soon as you're done. I don't want to see you otherwise. Do you understand, Redgrave? Completely, sir. Then that's all. Get the hell out of here. Okay, okay. Oh, maybe it's uh, Marco or Peter. So we can get those out of here. Safe. I will see how safe it is. Wait, do I need the Heimdall code for that safe? Oh, hi! Hi, Magda. Actually, since I don't have to wait in line, I'm just going to talk to you. Hi. Ah. Uh, what about the boss? Mr. Ferguson must be a strict boss. I do not discuss the management with employees. Okay. Uh... Uh, family, I already did that, the job. What about the weather today? Ha, Magda. Ah, it's still the same. So, what if I compliment you today? Okay, yeah, it's it's all the same. Okay, uh, in conversation. There we go. Blah, 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 blah. 
Haha, <laughs> I didn't have to wait in line. What do you say about that, huh? Not today. Okay, uh, security guard by the thingy meeting. I'm gonna talk to Marco. Marco? Ah. Uh, general chat. Uh, uh, talk about colleagues. Peter Dong, have I talked about me? Uh, yeah, okay, I have. What about the boss? He. Oh god. Why am I talking to this fuck? Marco Legrand reports only to himself. And it's just a matter of time until that fat sack of shit gets what's coming to him. I'll be taking his place soon. You'll see. Learn more. What's stopping you from taking his place right now? Everything is in his hands right now. The power on this floor and the money too. If I had that much money, I would buy the whole ministry. Why? When you have that much money, Evan, the question why becomes why not. Actually, I can see that point. Uh, yeah, I don't... I don't care about it. Blah, 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 blah. I am as back. I wanted to hack her stall and get the pills. But I guess we're not gonna do that right now. Hi, Peter. What do you... No, that's Nicholas. Why am I not fighting against Nicholas, by the way? Um, trade? Should we trade? Ask about Count? No. Uh, wait, what? I don't think I should do that. What about work? About the boss? I don't know much about, uh, about him. My job is to collect documents, not to kiss the boss's ass. Oh, why? That's what I'm doing. Uh, so you haven't heard anything at all. Everyone envies him. The big boss is a big shot and girls like him. While I ro roll the document card uh, back and forth, the he rolls in his private car with the ministry's young female employees. Do you know many people who own a private car? There's nothing else you can do ex except envy him. Okay, look. This guy just left. Oh, that's Peter Dong's. I probably need to put the pills there. Ah, f no, I have to, I have to do this. Go, 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 fast, fast. He might come back. Don't want to be backstabbed by the, by the dong. Uh, screwdriver. Why is that all you have? Do we have any dirt here? Quickly, quickly, quickly. Uh, pictures, ha, huh? oh, what a, with a kid, and then he does something, but then this, he likes trains, trains, he, he trains to be a train man, uh, Marcus, blah, 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 blah. uh, so with, with this is something, uh, I, I'm scared, because I feel like he might come back soon, uh, commissioner, that thing, uh, uh, yeah, uh, I should probably read all of this, but I, I, I'm too scared, I'm too scared, get out, ah, get out! I'm scared! He's gonna come back! Get out, please! Okay, I didn't do anything. Okay, okay, okay. We're fine. You didn't see anything there, Nicholas Page. Uh, hi. I didn't do anything. Uh, discuss the Patriot Adventures. It's a cool show! I know, right? I haven't missed a single episode. It's just... I just don't get why it's called the Patriot Adventures, when all they do is sit around and talk who's the best Patriot. What about the adventure part? That's just the beginning. Then they get, they all get arrested. Spoilers! And it gets really good. Keep watching. Oh, now I see. What do you want? Uh, uh, did we talk about the boss? Yeah, we did. Father, colleagues... Here we go. I avoid talking about the high ops and I advise you to do the same. Can you at least give me a couple of tips on how to best approach him? Tips! I've done everything by myself. Nobody ever helped me and I won't be helping anybody. Mom says you have to think for yourself. What about your mom? Tell me more. I'm not trying to collect dirt on you, Peter. I just want to know what he's like. Comrade Ferguson is a great boss with a lot of authority. A little while ago, he almost failed to meet the quota for processing appeals for the Ministry of Patriotism, so he ordered everyone to work overtime without a second thought. Nobody dared to argue with him. Can you imagine? I can imagine what would happen if someone did argue. Ooh, task upgraded. 
Wait, 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 what? Uh, bye, 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 Dong. Promotion. Game said that by getting promo- Oh, the, huh? Take money from the courier. Oh, okay, this. So now I need to call Cunningham. Uh, yeah. Uh, this. Yeah, okay, okay. Ah, uh, I need to go. Hi, how are you feeling today, Serena? Oh, ask about pills. Maybe she has some pills. Um, Serena, you've been working in the ministry for quite a while. Can you help me? I don't sell alcohol. You need a license for that. No, not that. But maybe you might have headache pills on you. My pies don't cause, cause headaches. I've only got laxatives. Need them? Ah, there we go. So we don't steal them from Emma. Well, they'll certainly make you forget about your headache. <laughs> I like this. Should we talk about family? No, let's just uh, ask about the boss. Never blinks and I passing by one tough cookie. Even tougher, like that government issue bread. Two bites and your teeth are broken. So I just give him my share and keep a low profile. Anyway, from the bosses, closer to the monies, you know? Does the butt... Does the butt... Does the boss not eat here? Are you nuts? People like him only dine in restaurants. And it's better that way. For them? For me. Foodies, foodies like that are too hard to please. Okay. I kind of want to talk about family, but I don't know if I can quote-unquote afford that right now. And then there's also this. Buy useful items. Well, I don't think we're in the territory to do all of those things yet. Oh, there we go. It's, wait, why is this pointing over here? Visitor in line. What the? Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, I need to uh, talk to this guy first. What? Comrade Ferguson sent me. You're the one I ought to get uh, into the line. Yes. You bring your package. Whoops. Well, go get it quick before the day is over. Oh, so that's what I need to do. Visitor in line. Where is this? Wait, wh wh what am I to do here? Take money from the courier. Are you the courier? Hello. What can I do for you? You talk to me. Thank you. The thing is, I can't get anyone to help me. My line over there isn't moving at all. I've been waiting for a week now and haven't moved an inch. Oh, it's probably my line because I'm never working. And how can I help? Just keep waiting. Everyone else does. But look at it, really. That window is closed. I can't just keep standing here. Can you check on the employees for that window? What if some things happen to them and I should go stand in a different line? Okay, fine. Okay, what window number is it? Number 101. I'll see what I can do. Okay, okay. Uh, who's the freaking courier? I want to listen in. The boss announced today that he has to cut our salary to reduce spending. What about his salary? Well, he bought himself a gold watch yesterday to see who comes late for work. Hmm. Um, where is this courier? I need that package. And then window 101. Uh, Nicholas. Is this 101? How do I know if it's 101? Uh. Huh. Hi, Marco. No, I don't want to talk to you. You're a shite. Where is one to find such a courier? Um. Wait, I have the pills. I should talk to Dong. Oh, here we go. Uh, window 101. No. What do you want? Okay, here's some pills. Peter, I found a great remedy for you. What does it do? The headache pills. I'm sorry. Take two. You'll forget all about your head. Well, we didn't lie. 
They look kind of funny. Where did you get them? Does it matter? Things can't get any worse. I think they can. I'm sorry. Don't shit in the fountain, please. Oh, boy. I'm so sorry, Peter. I actually feel bad. I feel bad. But at least now I can get Peter Grant off my case. Uh, Nicholas, who works in 101. Oh, is he my courier? Do you know anything about Window 101? Maybe. What exactly do you want to know? Do you know where I can find Window 101? Go left and after about 50 meters, take a look down the corridor on the right. You should be able to find it from there. Okay, and then counterfeit money? Comrade Ferguson told me that you'll give me a bundle of counterfeit money. Take this pen and sign the receipt form. Oh, always with the forms. And the warehouse bill. Okay. And the accident prevention training log. But there was no training. You're not getting anything until you sign it. I see. And give the pen back. Cool. Thank you. Okay, so 101. Is th that's probably Emma. Mm -hmm. Nope, but I should talk to her. Uh, ask about the boss. What do you think of our boss? He can't afford anything. He can afford anything he wants. He likes a dream. He's like a dream come true. I can't read. He'd be the perfect man if he wasn't married. Okay, uh, and then what about Peter Dong? Nothing, he's just a colleague. Oh yeah, right, I already read this. Uh, did all this. Do I really need to flirt with her? Screw it, here we go. Any plans for tonight? The usual. Finish some paperwork, watch TV and go to bed. There's a pretty girl like you really have nothing more fun to do after work. Is it really just more work and TV? This pretty girl would love to do something fun if the company is good. Any suggestions? No, not right now. Forget about it. I, I just feel bad doing it, but I think at some point I probably need to have uh, to lure her into the storeroom to do something. I did the freaking thing. I need that safe. Didn't we have a deal? You have to prank Dar Dong. I did. Use your friendship. Oh, we gotta uh, got this. I I did the thing. Did I not? Uh, wait. Okay, I'm just gonna do this, and I need to fill the quota. Oh hi, who hi? Looks like he had a heart attack, but no one noticed. An inconspicuous life, an inconspicuous death. I should tell security, let them deal with it. No pain, no gain. Find Office 101. Uh, achievement unlocked. Okay. Uh, should I do this now, or should I do... No, I have to go do the other things here. What do I need to do to... Peter Dong, do I need to talk to you again? How are you feeling? The toilet, that's where easy Peter breathe. Ah, uh, my head doesn't hurt anymore after what happened. Something else does though, the shame. Evan, did you have anything to do with it? Of course not. I'm not sure I believe you. What do you want? Nothing. Now I can probably do that. And he hates me now. Do, 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 talking to Le Grand. Ha I did it! Ah, fine. Okay, we have the money. I'll go do that. And then... I will go do my uh, quota for today. Hi, Peter. 
I need to play with his feelings of fear. Did I just give him laxatives for no reason? Wait, what security guard do I need to... Are you the one I need to do it to? Follow me, I'll take you to the line, then you're on your own. Okay, so we're doing this one first. I'm in a real hurry. Could you please let me cut it? If I let you ahead of me, I won't live to see next spring. Why? Can't you see? I'm 30 kilos underweight. Uh, here, look at my papers. If they don't give me some vouchers for a higher calorie diet soon, they'll be receiving a complaint from a very unsatisf unsatisfied pile of bones. Just help him, it's fine. Jump. No! Ah, not like that! They're gonna figure it out, you doofus! They're gonna... Oh... Go and steal something. What? I said I'm not giving you any money, so go and steal something, beggar. Uh, we can just bribe this one, I think. And why should I let you through? Because people should help each other. Just what kind of people, I wonder? And what do you mean, help? Um... Talk nonsense. I'm um, sorry, what? Well, you should look it up then. You think about that for now and just... And just I'll go on ahead, okay? Ah, it worked. Cool. No need to be rude, young man. Why do you say I'm rude? Your eyes tell me that you want to cut in line, even though there's a fragile and defenseless girl right in front of you? Ah, what happened to all the good men? You look lovely today. I'm sorry, it's just when I stand behind you, I'm so overcome by what I see in front of me that I completely lose my head. Unfortunately, I still need it for a meeting with my boss. You're a naughty one, trying to flatter me like that. You're lucky I have some free time. I couldn't let you get in trouble because of me, could I? Okay, slowly moving ahead. Young man, the fact that you're in a hurry is no reason to break uh, with established order. And that just emphasizes your lack of discipline. Looks like your supervisor from the Ministry of Labor isn't worth their salt. We didn't tolerate that sort of thing back in my day. Um, lie convincingly? You're wrong. My supervisor is a wonderful person. He's just waiting for me to bring him some papers so that he can file a report. That's why I'm in a hurry. I can't let him down. Why didn't you just say so? Go ahead. Okay, final person. I have heard in business too, but you don't see me trying to cut in line. No, because you are in front of the line. Maybe we should toss a coin. Uh, fine, why not? What do you choose? A leader. Ah, damn. Fine, go ahead. Okay, what do I do here? Hello? Um... Abram Sniperson. If you're a Sniperson, I'm a ballerina in the patriotic theater. But in our ministry, who cares? Go on. Well, recently my much-loved grandma was sent for the blissful sleep. Um... But the old hag hit some of her valuables in an armchair first. The chair was the requisitioned, was then re, yeah, by the state service funds. And I really need to know where it is now. Can you help? I can make it worth your while. What does make it worth your while mean? I'll give you a bribe. You guys take bribes, don't you? So I'll just bribe you so that you help me. 
It's not a bribe, sir. It's a contribution to the ministry fund. Yeah, whatever. Here's some money. Uh, money for you to take. How much is it, is in there? Enough to cover a couple of weeks at a resort. Like old patriot? Better than that, I'm talking about way of the leader or even the central. If you can do without that fancy electrolysis stuff. Whoa! That's what I'm saying. I'll leave this envelope here, all right? Come back tomorrow. I'll try and find something out. Ooh. Mm. What would I gain from saying that the money is fake? I don't think I would gain anything, to be honest. I, I have to play along for now. Okay. Um, now I need to find a sh security guard to um, to tell about the uh, the dead person. Mm -hmm. Where can I find a security guard? And then I should also actually do my job. Is it here? I dare not. Hmm. It has to be all the way outside then. Okay, I'm gonna do my job for a little bit just so I don't run out of time to do that. I think that would be very bad. Oh god, I need five quarters. Let me see here. Out of vouchers. The voucher department reports that there are no more vouchers in the department. New vouchers will arrive in the next quarter. Okay. I need to get these five right. Please. Where should I send my report on High Culture Week? Week Prison Edition. That... Information about... Culture... Oh, hang on. No, 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 no. Back. Print. Okay, that's good. Good start. Next. Some please. Are green apples still banned in our country? Uh, yes, that directive has not been re rescinded. I don't know. Then I have a complaint. Darik, uh, Darish Lucius from the circus has been juggling banned produce. It's a slab in the face for of our great people. The great people who years ago made the patriotic decision to tolerate red apples only. See. They also identified the culprit's name. So it has to be a denunciation. And then I think it is... Organization... See, this is not it. Um, I think it is order. Could be culture and sports since they uh, said circus. But it has to be a legal matter, right? Nope, it was sports or uh, culture. Okay, I think I, I get it now. The girls from our dorm have answered the Ministry of Patriotism's call and donated a hundred pairs of stockings to be upcycled um, into parachute courts. We'd rather go commando than leave the motherland without parachutes. Where should I leave our donation? Okay, so a donation. That has to be information, right? Information or documents necessary to the ministry. Yeah, it has to be information. And then... Patriotism. No! 
Oh god, okay, well, what was it? Question mark. Request? I have profiles of all the children at the kindergarten where I work, complete with photos and disgusting... No, distinguishing characteristics, I'm sorry. Everything's been done in strict accordance with form number 23 as requested. Now I hope we'll be able to get those new parties. The old ones are useless. Information and then... Uh, social care, right? Yeah, regulates kindergartens. There we go. So I think it, even if they say like, I would like to report a legal matter, but if they say like, it's about a school, then I should pick social care, even though it's a legal matter. Hello, I need to transfer some uh, academic records belonging to one professor Drumderry to the archive on account of his death. Information. And then... Science and technology, I think. Nope. Wait, what? Why was that office? It wasn't red. Ah, I clicked too fast. That's so dumb. Well, I have to do this. I only got two out of five. Whose husband, Bruno, is head of the passport desk. Uses a bust of our leader to weigh down her s sauerkraut. Okay, so... We got full name. That's uh, denunciation. And then... Um... Head of the passport desk. I, this is either order or patriotism, right? Um, I think it's order. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. It wasn't. With a surveillance camera and a microphone in accordance to the... With the patriotism law, th that doesn't sound like a good thing. I'm a, I'm the supervisor of a public toilet by the railway station. I've brought you all the video and audio recordings for this month, so that has to be information. Now, do we go for railway station? Because then it would be what. Um, tourism, sports, labor, uh, railway station, patriotism law. I don't know what ministry this one goes to. It's not order. Right? Um, and it's not really promoting an idea. Social care. No. It's not labor. Culture and sports. Nope. It, I, the only one I can think of is patriotism. And I got the office wrong again because I didn't check the day, uh, days. I only checked if it was green. Oh my god. I brought a poem to praise the great leader and our visit... Victorious deeds in the West. This patriotic masterpiece will stir up the whole country. 
I want to have it published in the next edition of the newspaper. Where can I leave it? Okay. Information. Page. No. Patriotism. Wednesday. Oh my god. Head of the fire department won't hire me because I'm a woman. Um... I'm a star. I was a star athlete. I've done hundreds of skydives. I've served in the army. But you're pregnant. Let those pansies from the music school whine about being pregnant. I demand that Kiusak uh, hire me. So that is a denunciation. Then labor. And then this. Thank you. Well, I only have one more form left, and I'm not going to be able to reach the quota. Um, report a violation of the family code. Yesterday, I went to get a trim at the leader's mustache uh, barber shop and witnessed George Mantuk, the hair service specialist, kiss another male in full view of the public. This is unacceptable. How can the ministry allow this? Who was the other male? That's not important. I mean, it was his uh, son, but citizens are forbidden from engaging in all contact with members of the same sex. So I'll say it again. How can the Ministry of Social Care allow this? Denunciation, social care. There we go. I am one short of the quota. But if I click this, I won't be able to do the quest today. I have to, I have to meet a quota. I don't have a choice. Yeah. Dang it. I'm pretty sure someone's been following me. I don't ever feel safe at home. Recently I came home from work and someone had gone through my... Had gone through my old stuff. The burglar was so good, he managed to get in without anyone noticing. Even the building manager didn't see anything, do something. So that has to be a complaint about order, right? It's a, it's a break-in. Or is it social care? Nope. There we go. So, now we got the quota. That's all I had to do today. I'm just gonna speed through the remaining four here. Uh, I'm a florist for the con con peace. So that's a denunciation. First mystery. Uh, that has to be... Security department. Order. Ah! I clicked too fast. I had it and then I cl clicked too fast, so it clicked reject. Our plant is criminally delaying the introduction of x ray. I see myself. Okay, I don't get this one. So that is a complaint about the science and technology, I guess. And then Wednesday. There we go. Catalog of clothes design. Uh, information for uh, 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 labor. In recently started working as uh, denunciation, science, and here we go. Nope.
Those more of our propaganda. Uh, we quest patriotism Wednesday. Nope. Okay. See, now the issue is that I have no more time. So if that uh, quest with telling the guard about uh, the dead body requires time, I'm effed. But I can't even find that guy. It's set to go and talk to the security guard, right? Where am I? Oh, I need to play with all three of those feelings. So we played his uh, weakness feelings. Now we need to play fear and passion. Okay. Um... Window 101. Tell security guard about the dead. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, map. It has to be here then, right? Yep. Here we go. Please don't take time. Because then I'm screwed. Why? Why what? Why is there a dead body or why is it in 101? Why don't I know about it? I have no idea, but now you know. I'll handle it. Dismissed. Thank you for your service. That's it. Yep. Uh. Nah, probably I don't have anything to say. Yeah, okay. Minute. And then I need to report back to Ferguson, too. Wait, why am I doing it like this? Just do this. I am fast travel. Here we are. I have good news and bad news. Which do you want first? Bad. The employee from that window died from exhaustion. Exhaustion. At his desk a week ago. That's awful. What's the good news? You're now free to go stand in a different line. You know what? I think I'll just go home. I wanted to get a reward for turning in banned books, but I doubt it'll cover my expenses. You can take the, the book if you want. I'm not carrying it back home. Okay. Probably a skill. Uh, let's see if I'm right. Uh, here we are. Universal adv advice. New skill. Water supply discount. Ooh. If we could, could get that before I pay the water bill, that would actually be really good. And, okay, Ferguson. Well, crap. I can't get past her. I have to stand in line, even though I don't need to talk to Magda. Okay. Work phone, maybe? Nope, can't do that. Oh, well. Guess I'll just go home, then. Oh, boy. Um... We can call Cunningham and report. Do you have anything new to say? Nope. I'm not gonna talk to you. So at least we can clear the quest with Cunningham. New bill arrived, new bill arrived. Who is it? Someone's pissing? Who are you and what do you want? Hello, how can I help? Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Simon Valois, the manager of this wonderful building. 
Evan. I'm very pleased to meet you indeed. How are you settling in? Is everything okay? Maybe you need some help. Everything's fine, although I wish the bills would come less often. Tell me about it. If it were up to me, I wouldn't take money from my residents at all. But you know, work. I was just joking, Simon. Ha ha ha, I love people with such a fine sense of humor. I'm sure we'll get along just great. My wife, Margaret, makes wonderful cow, cow tail aspic. Come visit us sometime. It's my treat. Okay, I'll come by sometime. I'm sorry, Simon, but I'm pretty tired after work and could do with some rest. Was there something you wanted to ask me? Oh, forgive this old fool. Uh, I'll only take up another minute of your time. It's embarrassing to talk about, but all the tenants here have to donate to the overhaul found fund as soon as possible. If you're short on cash, then just give as much as you can, but the money is needed urgently. I'll just donate 50, that's fine. No problem, sorry for disturbing you. All the best, have a good evening. Naive, give money to the swindler. You penis. Oh, you... Ah, I hate you. Okay, well... Dial number. Call James Cunningham. I talked to my colleague about uh, Ferguson. And what did you find out? Nothing unusual. They didn't mention anything that could be used against him. Keep watching. We need to find a good reason to arrest him. And submit this information uh, via the reports line. You could do with some more authority. Okay. Okay, that gave us a little bit of money. No, actually, oh, I don't want to do this yet. Building manager fee 500. Holy moly. Okay. Um... I want to go read the book first. Because then I don't have to pay as much for the water bill. Read. There we go. Okay, so that's gonna take six days to read. Because I also need to watch my show here. And I wanna uh, watch the new one. The one I haven't watched yet. So I have something to talk to my colleagues about. This one. Let me do this. Now I know about the passion of the leader. So whoever talks about that one. I can now share some. Uh, some talk with. Uh, we can do one more day. I've got the time. Um, so what we need to do in this one, I think immediately we need to go and talk to Ferguson. And then what? Uh, I don't know. Map, there we go. Get in line, that's fine. Talk to Magda. Maybe she wants to talk about something. General chat. Nope. Okay. Okay, here goes. Who do you think you are? Vaulting into uh, Comrade Ferguson's office without knocking. There we go. Hi, Peter. Oh, Pete. Um, ask about this floor. Do I have nothing else to do? How do does the first floor manage to meet all the quotas? After all, they, they get bigger and bigger all the time. But the number of employees doesn't change. The first floor, I'm the only one who does anything around here. I work my fingers to the bone while these layabouts lounge around in their booth. 
The first floor is the foundation of the whole ministry, and I'll prove that they can't manage without me. Manage watch? What? Uh, none of your business. Okay, report the bribe. I've completely completed your mission? Excellent! Now, if this wise guy doesn't give me every last penny, he's toast. It's a woman. Gender has no bearing on professional character. Thank you. You've shown me that you're not a complete imbecile like the rest of them. Your next job is to go to the office, collect money and bring it back to me. What money? How slow can you be? Government money, Redgrave. The money our moronic visitors give to our idiotic co-workers for the good of our great country. Your colleagues already know how much they owe me. And if they forget, Raku, it will remind them. Okay, I'll do it. That's the right answer to the near march. And close the door behind you. Okay, okay, okay. But now we have some authority. That's good. Could use some more money, but I'm stupid. So I don't make much money in my, uh, in my forms filling. Uh, what about the money? Comrade Ferguson has ordered me to collect contribu contributions from my colleagues. What contributions? To whom? I don't contribute anything to anyone. That is a blade blatant lie and slander. Well, contributions to the state on his behalf. Ah, you mean the bribes. Say it straight and stop mumbling. You need to bring him an amount that's going to look nice sitting in his safe. Small change won't do. Thousand will be fine. Now what? Okay, I need a thousand gold. Do I need that today? Or... Marco. I need it with the money. Are you his errand boy now? It's not my place to argue with the boss. There's no arguing with that fat bastard. So what about the money? I don't have any money. We're in a recession and the market is stagnating. Do you even know that term? Okay, cool. I could break in and see if he actually has some money. Uh, Emma, do you have money? We're not so close that I trust you to take anything to Comrade Ferguson for me. Okay, so... Passion of the leader. Okay, now can we money? Nope. Okay. Um, submit information about colleagues. There we go, got some authority, that's good. Okie dokie. Um, Nicholas, do you know about money? Nope, okay. Peter Dong, do you know about money? The report, it's almost finished, I just... No, Peter, not the report, but it's also made of paper, but smaller in size, with numbers and the portrait of our leader on it. Oh, you mean the bribes. It's all here, down to the last coin. Okay, cool. Um, is there anything else I can do right at the moment here? No. Oh, well, I fat-fingered again. Do you know where I can buy some other useful little things? That courier, Paige, has something for sale. There's also a merchant, but he might be hard to find. Do you know where I can find him? He used to work at 6 blah 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 street and then moved past uh, Enlightenment Square. Enlightenment? No, Enlightenment. The letters on the sign faded out, so they entered it into the register like that. Look for him there. How will I recognize him? You'll know him when you see him. He wears an old-fashioned top hat to make himself more noticeable from afar. You shouldn't have any problems. Oh, no. Hang on. I wanted to... 
Uh... Sure, talk about family. Do you have kids, Serena? Why? Do you want to be a dad? No thanks, I'm good with the one I've got. Just cu curious how you managed to do so much. What do you want to know? How many kids do you have? Had three. One got drafted during the first Western campaign. The war did away with him in a month. The second one showed up again recently. Shell shocked says he got discharged. Huge fella with baby brain. Gotta feed him like a toddler. My third one? Oh well, I'm talking too much. Gotta go. Uh, where's your husband? Ate too many pears. What do you mean? I once brought uh, home some pears for my youngest. Youngest traded for him um, at a market. Uh, and that drunken swine knocked back a bottle of moonshine and ate them all. And what happened? Well, I was young, strong. He fell very ill, so to say. I remember the blood gushing out of his nose and everything. And that's how he died. Food poisoning. Terrible business. Are your parents alive? After our youngest... Uh, why do I say youngest? Youngest um, was born. They invited us to the city to live with them. They have a huge room in a social housing there. So there are five of us, but at least there's always someone to change the IV when you need to. IV? My youngest was born sick, needs meds, and I'm no nurse. All I know is how to make pies. Is anyone helping you? Sure, the leaders tender care in our constant victories on the battlefront. Are you kidding? What do you mean? Can't you see how I'm practically basking in care? Okay. Um, what am I doing here? Is there a purpose to me going this way? Yes, so I can listen in. Never walk around the office empty-handed. Take a folder with you, some papers. It doesn't matter what. Why? They find anyone who doesn't have papers. Okay. Have to have papers on me. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about this room. Hi, landscaper. What are you doing? Hi. Uh, let's praise the glorious leader. And let's get back to our stall here. Hang on. Okay, we did all with him. Listen, I might as well do this since I did all the thing with the lady. Trade. Foreign currency by counterfeit money. Ah. I don't know what I would need that for. Okay. I don't know. Uh Oh, Le Grand is out. Okay, I'm gonna sneak into his uh, place because I have a feeling that he has some money lying in his uh, thingy thing here. But I need, need to be fast. Really fast. I clicked out the game. Oh, I can't. Uh, check his uh, thing. Uh, yes. He was an evil prick. Money. We have discussed him in time, but promotion is out of question. Sex education, pamphlets, and much more. Okay. Uh, didn't really give me much. Wrong button. And no, she's coming back. Uh, let's see here. What did we do? Hmm. I need to bring a thousand to him. I do have that, but I also need to save the money for my uh, bills. So, I need to somehow collect more money. I know I'm gonna earn a little bit by uh, doing the um, um, the forms, but that's not enough. 
get promoted. Hmm. Well, can't do anything else. I really need to hit everything here. I recently discovered that Carpenter's reports about coffins for the front were not marked as confidential, thus violating directive blah blah blah. So this is an order. Whenever they are violating a directive, this has to be an order. We really spell it for you. Find whoever took re receipts of these reports and have them executed for negligence. 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 Uh, that has to be a complaint, order, and this. Yes, there we go. Good start. I've brought list of students nominated for scholarships in scientific work and trench digging. I need to be careful because I always think think that this is information but it could also be this no it has to be information and then school uh yeah it has to be and then here we go yes okay Two for two so far. That's good. Complained about the management of our factory. Yeah, so that is a complaint. Let the girls join the volunteer militias. Okay, so complaint, labor, and today, and check. Oh, so the quota is just to get the reward. Okay, I get it. From latest military sport games, as well as su submit a report on the ensuing casualties. Information, sport, this. I'm doing good now. Okay, last form. I'd like to file a complain complaint against this person, so that's a denunciation. High school teacher, and he doesn't know a thing about what he's teaching. Um, which one is the school one? Oh, social care has to be. And here, and there we go. Five for five. Look at me, and out I go. I think I did pretty well there. Um, yeah, let's let's do it. I want to see if he, uh, if Peter Dong is stocking up some money. Nope, he isn't. I think Legrand is lying. I think he indeed does have money, but he just doesn't want to tell me. He wants to keep them for himself. I'm gonna go, th go through your cart. Nothing, cool. Now I'm just wasting time all over the place. Ah. Um, okay. She's gonna leave now. We're gonna check her booth. Here we are. Ooh, you have a visitor. What's up, what's up with that? Um, this one. Uh, no. I'm not gonna steal it. 
Maybe later, but not right now. Okay, so that was a lot of wasted time just now. I'm so mad that I can't hack his uh, thing. Um, do I need to go give the leader the money today? Is there a time constraint on it? Get promoted, play with his feelings, competitive environment, and then this. I don't know if I have to do that leader's quest today. Hi, Peter. Can I play with your uh, passion and or fear? Mm, nope, it doesn't seem like I can. Yeah, we've already talked about all of this. Um. Okay, I'm gonna take a chance and say that I do not need to do the leader quest today or finish it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back. No, I'm actually gonna make a save file just in case. And then we're gonna go back and I'm gonna read the book, watch my TV series and then call it an episode. Here we are. Heading out. <clears throat> Made a little bit of progress today and we are getting better at uh, the forms. Getting the right forms and the right offices. Skill lost. Knowledge about the... Huh, why? Who's this guy now? I'm gonna take the phone first. Uh, Pick up the phone. A call from the wife. Hello dear, it's so nice to finally hear your voice. Sorry darling, I have had so much work. How are things going with the new job? Everything is great. I sit in the ministry, process visitors, shuffle papers around. Have you found anything out about your father? I'll tell you when I see you. I won't be coming soon, dear, but I understand that it's not a conversation for the telephone. Just do what you have to do. Everything is good with the two of us. I'm so glad to hear that. Could you say it again? We're fine, Evan. We don't need anything and everything's calming, Redding. Uh, focus on your work, dear. I know it's important to you. So tell me about the department. Do you like it? It's fine. Our girl will finally have her own room. I really want to see you. So do I. I have to go now. Hang up. No, you hang up. <laughs> really? Okay. Bye bye. Hang up. Okay, fine, I'm coming, I'm coming. Shut up. What do you want? How can I help? My name is Casper Pullman. I'm the manager of this building. Here's my ID. Oh, thank you. My name is Evan Redgrave, and I've already talked to the manager. What was his name? Simon Valois? That old drunk from the third floor, a manager? That's what he said. And he probably asked you for money. Yes, for the overhaul found. That scoundrel. If you see him again, chase him away and let me know. I'll deal with him. I didn't know. Thanks for the warning. But let's get down to business. As the building manager, I have to familiarize you with the rules of tenancy. Yes, of course. So, Evan, you live in a building for civil servants. It is forbidden to make noise litter, keep pets, and lock the doors. Lock the doors? Well, how else can I check that you're following these rules? Anything else? 
So there are about 150 points here, but I can see that you're an intelligent person and can read them yourself. By the way, you'll face immediate eviction if you break the rules. I understand. And don't forget to pay your bills. And turn off the tap. And switch off the lights. Goodbye. Okay. Uh, wait, what happened here? Nothing? Okay. Where are these uh, things? Things that I can do. I already read that. Where do I read the the rules of the tenancy here? Okay, well, fine. Um. Well, I have to do these two. And then I'll actually go and read the book first. Oh, I should have done that before I paid the bill. I'm stupid. So what we're going to do is one, two, three, four, five. There we go. Uh, so now we get a discount on our water supply. <clears throat> What do you want me to do? I can't do anything of these. Oh, I probably have to watch them daily to not lose them. That's why I lost the skill. Okay, well, at least now I know. Um, but that will have to wait until the next episode because I'm going to leave Behold the Two here for now. Um, as I said, we did make a little bit of progress. We uh, got a little better at filling out the forms and we got to talk to the big boss at least the big boss of floor one um i'm a little worried that i had to give him the money today so he's gonna be pissed at me for not paying up but i will just have to wait and see um if i failed that quest or not um i think legrand is lying i think he does have money and just wanna don't want to hustle up it was probably in that email but i didn't get to read it because i got so scared so i felt like i have to get out of there quick but um but yeah so uh, in the next one we will be digging up more dirt and we'll be kissing the boss's ass a little more and uh just all around do our job here and do some scheming and some spying and having some fun yeah but that's what's up for the next episode. But for now, I will leave it here. Um, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you in the next one. Alright. I am out.